Yo guys, I am back. However, I'm not playing um, Devil May Cry 5, which I actually fucked up the part 2 of. Um, but I'm, I'm on Life is Strange. Because I recently went to go buy GTA Plus and I was like, Oh, Life is Strange Remastered is on there, the complete edition. For any 30 odd quid. So I was like, do not fuck it. I want to buy both. So I bought GTA Plus, but I also bought Life is Strange Remastered, and I really wanted to go through it because um, I saw it that it came out like last year, like really late last year, like December-ish, and I was like really holding off buying it. But I just want to fucking buy it. Holy fuck, they redid this entire thing. Finish previous episode to play, so it doesn't count the fact that I've finished um, the actual version. So I might, what I might do is I might show bits and pieces from the game, um, like individual pieces, because remastered seems like it would be so much better to play. And also, for Life is Strange Before the Storm, I'm going to play the remastered version because I now own it. Because the remastered collection came with both Life is Strange and Life is Strange Before the Storm. So I'll be showing you guys Life is Strange Before the Storm remastered, not the original one. Although, I will show clips of the original one if I can. As you know, I can. I'll, I'll, show, I'll try and show clips from the original one if I don't get too left behind in it. Anyway, um... <laughs> What I might do is I might do, might play Life is Strange Remastered because I had no idea I was going to buy this. So I might do like episodes of Life is Strange again. You know, what? I'm going to. Welcome to Life. I'm going to say welcome myself to Life is Strange Remastered. Let's get into it. They changed the fucking. That music is so nostalgic. And here we go. This cuts this cutscene is already better. It's already so much better. Yeah, the game's looks have definitely been upgraded. Because Max's hair isn't just like a texture anymore, like it was in the first, like it was in the original. It's actual like hair now. What the hell have they done to your face? I can. What's happening? It doesn't look. It doesn't look like she has hair. Her face doesn't look like she has hair. How did I I'm just gonna critique this game now. Where is here? Okay, she looks different. Wait, there's the lighthouse. I'll be safe if I can make it there. I hope. Please let me make it there. This game looks monumentally better. Monumentally. It looks like a game. It look it genuinely looks like a game that was upgraded. It genuinely it doesn't look like a game that was upgraded, it looks like a game that came out like two years ago. And not Eight years ago. Oh wait, yeah, this isn't the part of the story where you where you have rewind. You also can't skip to nothing. Holy hell! The storm got a major up. Oh no, it didn't. It's still just a bunch of two D fucking textures. It's still just a bunch of two D pissing. Could they not bother with that? I mean, some of the two D textures changed out, but not all of them. What the hell? I would have critiqued this game so hard. Because I'm a massive Life is Strange. I have actually played Life is Strange quite a bit, like trying to get different endings and stuff. This game actually does look a hell of a lot better. Where's the bench? Because there's a bench or something that hits us. Oh no, it's the spotlight house. That was so surreal. Oh, little pieces of time. Did they just struggle to do like loading out the window? I'm in class. Everything's cool. I'm okay. 
Okay, it looks like shadow. From it color, the game the looks hero. a lot now, better. Can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't fall asleep. And this game does I look like it got a like definite a upgrade from the original Where? one. Diane Arbus. <laughs> there you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. I should take a picture on. to prove I'm still here. Plus, it's perfect for my portfolio. Hang on, hang on, hang on. my daily selfie quota. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? Press triangle to take yourself with that look. chose to capture people at the height of their beauty or innocence? Also, when he says capture them in an innocent dark corner, if none of you have actually watched my part, selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful um, tradition, and one or two of my final um, episodes, you, you would know what I'm talking about. <clears throat> since the early 1800s. Actually, if you haven't watched episode, if you haven't watched my original series on Life is Strange, please go and watch it. And also, please, um, if you if you if you don't mind spoiling yourself, go to the end of that. So go to episode five, part one or two, and just rewatch them because that will tell you the story and that will tell you why I'm say saying. Uh, because I, I will try not to spoil it, but I'm going to spoil it anyway. But if you haven't watched those, please go and watch um my original st series on Life is Strange. But I'm gonna be playing remastered. Uh, only a few, only a few bits because I really shouldn't be uh, you know i'm gonna critique the entire i'm you know i'm gonna replay the entirety of life is strange remastered just because i want to critique the boss <laughs> yeah that's what i'm gonna do that's what i'm gonna do to use images for selfie expression however what i'm also gonna so, do i couldn't resist however what i'm going to do is i'm gonna go one episode of life is strange to a two part one part the one one part of one episode of Life is Strange Remastered, and I'll do two like uh, two parts. I can't speak. Two parts of Devil May Cry, uh, just so you guys can have something. The point yeah. remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you oh, they have fucked up his eyes. Conversation, can you please? Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. Uh, wait, you're asking me? I no, wait, hang on. What are the what the square option was most recently thing? You're asking me? Oh no, it's the same for this one. Um. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Bitch. Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American Daguerreotype self-portrait was done by... If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Hang on, I can't be asked to read any of this. Is this just replay? Yes. Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. But, yeah, like, genuinely, it... Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she. Of course, Victoria has. To... I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Well, Maria, there you go. Already, I do like the style of this game. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. 
Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna read that just for decency reasons. Hi, Kate. Oh, hi, Max. It's got better. You, have just by you seem quiet today. <laughs> just thinking too much. No matter who wins, this is just a bump on a bigger. I hear that. Want to go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? It okay, seems a lot better today. with the. I have to go over homework. I, I don't know if this game was mocap. If it was. Sure. I don't think it had face mocap. Um, actually, let's do this because I don't think I took it in the original one because this is the first picture you can ever take. Oh, macro. Yep, that was, that's the first photo you can ever take in the game. I see you, Max Caulfield. That don't this game is glitchy. <laughs> I've been having these little audio glitches, even though I have the best headset you can have for PlayStation. I'd never let one of But Jesus Christ, is this game glitchy with visual glitches? I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude like Yes, shit. it is, though. Shut but up. Life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. <clears throat> Mom. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. You Welcome are. to the real world. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture of Jerry. What's the point of even having this last year? I'm not paying for this. She plays it so sharp. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. So black rod lists for what? Art. Make sure I don't look like a total loser. Art and science. When do those two things... When do those two things mix? Hi, so gang. If you say science art, I swear. If anyone says science art in the comments, my god, do I want to kick your teeth in. Because there is science art, yeah, I'll give you that. But it's just, science and art just don't mix most of the time. I think the music is the original one. Yeah, music's the same as the original one, but it's way louder. It's way louder. It's it's actually quite a bit louder. Empty, good. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. Yeah, it it's it's pretty much fu it's pretty loud in this. Hang on. Now, who would bother to write that crap? Oh my god. So, <laughs> if you don't know why I'm laughing, go check out my um, episode 1 part 1 on this game. Because they moved this from over here to this and changed its font. And also changed the fact that none of it's in caps. Well, what? Three letters are in caps. <laughs> what the f I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started with that bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? What? That sounds usually for when you've done an action that affects time. This action does nothing. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Ah, oh, fuck it. Fuck it. Oh, why do I always get that wrong? When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Was that text move as well? Yes, that text was okay, moved bro, as well. Get a photo op My like this God. Every day. This I hate Victoria Chase thing was over there or on the wind or on a mirror, I'm pretty damn sure. I'm not gonna look at it.
That was already... Okay, hang on. I know they don't bother to do... Oh, God. I've looked at screenshots of this game, and it does seem like Nathan Nathan. definitely got a... Don't stress. A res up. You're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. Let's see Chloe. So what do you want? She definitely check the perimeter is her like hair is more blue say. than anything. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh boo hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around oh, with. Oh God. What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even. The hot eyes just widen. Get that gun away from me, psycho! No. So. I, for clarity reasons, I don't, what I'm going to do is because, um, I want this cutscene to be in, I'm, actually, Whoa. for clarity what reasons, I'm only going to get out a How? minor bit How of that cutscene, which is the actual gunshot itself. He shot that poor girl. Oh, Max is actually crying. Hand, and then I was back here. Is no one noticed that Max is crying? These pieces of time can frame us. In I already world. heard this lecture. From light to shadow, from color. To now shadow. Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Oh now, shit! Can you give me an example of a photographer? Man, that produced glass to shatter. Black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller, can I actually reverse time? Go, Victoria. Can Why it? it let me because do the thing. There we go. They've made the animation better. Yeah, that produced did glass it? from the bottom I of it. actually it's did it. A photographer who perfectly I'm captured a human the time machine. Black and white. They use the actual dialogue. Max, don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. When I took my Why selfie, this? Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Ugh. I know I'm not dreaming this. As you all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Oh, has she doesn't know it's Chloe yet. Art and photography I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. What's with the Julia pictures? But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me he after class. And I need time to save that girl. What is with my audio? A sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Hang on. Give me a second. Post any bar. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? I can't do the. <laughs> oh my god, they did not finish pouring no this game over to. Here. They, they, they didn't. Shut up, Max. They <laughs> did they port this game over from PC because if they did, they did a they did they did kind of a whole whole job because they literally left the right mouse button to rewind in there. <laughs> now, Max, what the fuck? since you've captured our interest, in also um, the L one doesn't work. Tell us the name of the skipping to it. Birth. To the first self portraits. The Daguerrean process and the Daguerrean I can't... process. Invented by a French painter named Louise Daguerre around 1830. Somebody 
has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. Oh, that smile is creepy. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everything. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be defended by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. Uh. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Wait, can I not talk to Kate again? Nice answer, Max. Are you okay? You look pale. Kate, um, did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just dripping. Too much stress. I know the feeling. Everyday Heroes is an important cultural event, and I want to represent Blackwell Academy. I have to go. Too much happening right now. Sure. Oh my word. This is just a bump on a bigger road. I don't want anybody to feel excluded. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. It's an entry, not a. Oh my god, it's not an exam. Go away with your entry I'd never BS. Let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about a thousand pics by now. It'll take a long time to find a good one. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. There we go. Now it allows me to use L1. You know what? I'm going to do this. Just to be annoying. I don't want anybody to feel excluded from this process, but I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about... So he calls her Max, even her though her actual name is Maxine Caulfield. Never let one of photography's Wait. future stars... Oh, it still works. in her picture. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Oh, you creep bastard. What's the... Oh, this. If I want to be an everyday hero... I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Right. The thing that please, I do is I just... Please. Oh, <laughs> it, it genuinely won't let me rewind faster than that. Hang on, I want to see what happens with these lot. Did they fix the animation? They stop you from rewinding at a certain point. Really? Okay, Max, retrace every They step. stop you from rewinding at a certain point. I washed my face. But the other thing is, I they don't have the original phone. animation. I'm guessing then, uh, you caused epilepsy or something like that? I flew in. And I took a photo. Or seizures? Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am, or who you're messing around with! Where did you get that? What are you doing? Don't Put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I need I'm a so hammer to break it open! People trying to con oh, I can't go back further, I need to let go! Tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble! Tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. Another shitty day. Yeah, and because of happen. us, this um, cannot be real. Nathan Prescott didn't get I taken just saw down. I get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? 
That means you should be outside. I had to use the David. Bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Was that mother? Hang on. Her footsteps are in my left ear, but not my right. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm. I'm. Just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. So these have been upgraded a little. Well, I'm gonna do the same thing that I did in the thing. I just saw that Nathan I did in my Prescott original one. Waving a gun around. In the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. Hang on, I think they've just reused every bit of dialogue and movement. I think they've just upgraded the graphics. That's all they've done. You sure. And yes. moves. He was in the bathroom. Little things to around. With a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's <laughs> most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girl's bathroom. So what happened next? Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell okay. now. I'm gonna try and do the best things I can to save people, but it might go a bit badly because I what I think I can do is I can save a bird. I, I'm going to sign a petition. Um, and some other things. So no marks actually appear when you're pressing the skip or rewind buttons when you're in a cutscene. Would Nathan Prescott please come to the front office? Thank you. So I can't currently see a bird, and this Rachel wasn't in the original game. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. Do you want to read it? There you go. Huh. You weren't forced to read that in the original. You, you had to come across it and do it yourself. Where's the bird? Hmm. I, I don't know if the bird's still in this. I'm just gonna talk to Miss Grant and Grant. stuff. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition. But would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. I can see both sides. You're fair-minded, Max. And we all pray Rachel is found safe and sound, bless our soul. No, she's already dead and married. But this petition isn't about her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Blackwell is that old? 
That's incredible. You should learn a little history about your alma mater. You'll find some fascinating facts. There's a lot of power in this region. I think it helps the creative juices flow around here. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? That's a mega drone. But the thing is, yeah, I can, I, I, I want to sign, but I also don't. Yeah, you know what? I want to sign it. Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. I am now going to uh, rewind because I actually don't want to sign that because I know David is a huge part in the story, so. Wait. They did use the original I thing. I go so far back in time. So where's that bird? One. Okay, I better oh, get yeah. and grab that flash drive. Why is that like a female version of Adrian and, L and Lila coming down the thing? You know what? I'm gonna leave it there. And. <laughs> you... <laughs> hmm. Come on, Logan, bring it, bro. This game has been well, well, very, very well, nicely done. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Right. I am going to leave this here. I'm going to see all of you legends in the next one because I don't want to be recording for too long. So, I'll see all of you legends in the next one. And if I do decide to do more Life is Strange Remastered, I'll let I will certainly you'll certainly see it. Um However, I thank you all for watching and I will see all of you legends in the next one. Bye-bye.